my name is Lauren and welcome to the beautiful city of Atlanta, Georgia. I just got back from a long bike ride and I am starving. And I'm looking for a delicious, quick, easy lunch recipe that won't counteract all the hard work that I've just done. So come on inside, let me get cleaned up, and I will share with you my chicken Philly curry recipe. I'll see you soon. Bye. Alright, I am back and I am starving. Time to make a great meal that's simple, easy, full of whole grains, lean protein, and low fat. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to start with two ounces of Kraft Philadelphia cream cheese. We're going to use the one-third reduced fat cream cheese to reduce the fat in this recipe. So you got two ounces. We've got our curry mixture here. It's got one half tablespoon of curry powder plus one quarter teaspoon each of celery salt, onion powder, and garlic powder. We have one half teaspoon of lemon juice and two tablespoons of milk. I'm going to give this a quick stir just a little bit, just try to mix it up just a little. So this Craft uh, Philadelphia, Real Women of Philadelphia contest has been a wonderful experience for me. It has just reopened my eyes to the things that I had forgotten that I loved. I love cooking, I love baking, I love being in the kitchen. I'm going to put this in the microwave for about 20 seconds so we can thin it out a little bit. And when I first heard about this contest, I just couldn't believe my ears. I was unbelievably excited. I was trying not to jump up and down out in <laughs> the middle of the store in a Paula Deen book signing because the thought of having recipes published, much less helping to create a uh, cookbook is just more than I can imagine. It would just be a dream come true, more than I could have ever thought. So I'm going to bring this out and give it a stir. And you'll see the time in the microwave just helped thin it out just the right amount so you've got a nice smooth sauce. I'm going to add in a cup and a half of leftover chicken. Um, this was just baked chicken that I had the other night and I just had some extras. You can always use rotisserie chicken and remove the skin and that will get rid of any of your extra fat. And give this a quick stir. Now I'm sure a lot of you have heard quite a bit about all the different benefits of things like curry powder and garlic powder. They have antioxidant properties, they've got cardiovascular benefits, and just overall good immune system health. So these are all things that I like to incorporate into my diet to help boost my immune system and make sure that I'm a little bit stronger. And there's something else that you can do to make it just that much more immune boosting can add in a couple of drops of hot sauce. I don't think I'm quite courageous enough to do that today, but if you are interested, that would be a great idea. It'll boost your metabolism and it'll boost the, all the antioxidant effects. I'm going to stick this back in the microwave for another 15 seconds or so, just 15 or 20 seconds, just to make sure that the uh, chicken is all warmed up and be good to go. So next, once that's all ready to go, I've got a whole grain pita here. it would be a nice source of whole grains as well as my vegetables. Some of the things that you can do, um, rather than what I have here, I have spinach and I have tomatoes. Some of the other things that you can add is, are things like arugula or broccoli or um, sugar snap peas, you can, radishes, you can this is where you could really get creative with this dish and it's still super easy. All right, looks like everything is all mixed and ready to go. I'll have to give this just a little bit of a taste to make sure I've got 
all the spices the way I like it. Hmm. That is great. So like I was saying before, I've had a wonderful time with this contest. I've been so excited. It's really funny. Every weekend, I wake up earlier than I wake up for work. Just thinking of all the different things I can create. It has really just gotten my creative juices flowing. I can think, I sit there and I think about, oh, how can this be different? How can I change that to make this better? How can I use the Kraft Philadelphia cream cheese in such a way to make it new and different and exciting and be something that would be universal that a lot of people would love. And you know what? I had forgotten what that was like. I had forgotten what it felt like to be super excited every morning. To have something in mind that just gets your blood pumping. I wake up, I take the dogs for a walk, and that's all I can think about. I just lay in bed and I'm like, what can I do to make myself better at these videos, to make myself better just in general, to make myself a lot more excitable, take myself a lot less seriously, as Paula Dean would say. And you know what? A transformation has been happening, and I just cannot believe it. It's been wonderful. No matter what happens from this contest, I have learned so much about myself, about what I'm capable of, about what makes me happy in life, that I will never forget it. <laughs> and while I was standing there talking and just yammering on and on, I took half of my chicken mixture and I stuffed it into my whole grain pita with my spinach and my tomatoes and look at that, lunch is ready. It was super quick, super easy, it's great for your body. You know what, with all the great things that you have with this, you serve it with you know, grapes and some water and you've got just the perfect meal. Look at this. We have got a low fat meal using the one third reduced fat Philadelphia cream cheese. We have whole grains from the whole wheat pita. We've got lean protein from the chicken. There's no skin. It's not cooked in fat. It's not fried or anything like that. It is just pure chicken. It's nutritious. Look at this. You've got all these different colors in here. You've got brown from the whole grains. You've got green from the spinach. You've got red from the tomatoes. Yellow from the curry. And these are all wholesome and whole foods that are a great addition to your diet. And you know what? Look at that. Look how quick it was. I stood here and started yammering half the time. It just was done before I knew it. And on top of that, it's delicious, and I can't wait for you to try it. Whoop, let's make sure we don't knock everything over here. <laughs> so, I think it's time for lunch. I'm going to run off now because I'm starving. It's been a long day and a long bike ride, and I hope you enjoyed my Philly chicken curry recipe. I hope to see you soon. Bye! Mmm, just wonderful. <laughs>